Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, the first thing I want to do is take the time to say thank you to those who decided to click on the link and join Tome. Um, Tome, excuse me, Tome. Tome, if you are not understanding the software, we'll talk about it just briefly. But what I did is I downloaded Balabolica. Balabolka. Balabolka is a Russian software, ladies and gentlemen. And this, the chatterer, is what it translates to. I'm going to let Balabolka. Let's see if I can get the voices. We don't want the voice. Let's see if we can find a voice. We're going to do American. No, let's do British. Okay. And we're going to let the young person, whoever it is, speak. We're going to pick up the pace. We're going to pick up the pace just a little bit, if it lets me. No, that's too much. So we can't go all the way to four. I guess we'll leave it at four. Let's see if we can bring it back. We'll do three. And the pitch, we'll have him... Uh, what his, uh, somebody hurting him. We're going to bring his pitch up. Uh-oh, don't want no name. And this is similar to the other tools that I've used. I just got to find a voice. And the young man, I just watched the video, and he was showing about this. And he, oh, sorry, I said I got to find a voice. I already found the voice. Sorry, you can see how distracted I am. There is so much going on. Dude, Um, now I got to figure out how to play because I didn't. I don't see the play button. Where you at, play? Where's kid at, play? Get in play. And it must be at the bottom. So let me shorten this so we can see the bottom. Because right now, I'm downloading OneNote. And I can't see the bottom. Um, fall into the gap. I don't see it. So we'll have to do it this way. Does it give me a play button? It doesn't give me a play button. I'm going to have to pause y'all while I find out how to play. I know you're all shouting this right here, but that's so small I wasn't even looking at that. This is just like uh, text aloud. It's the same format, same button. This is what you should know. Tax credits are dollars that reduces a person's tax burdens and will continue to do so indefinitely until depleted. It can be applied to back taxes for up to five years. These credits, as a result of bad debt deductions and their net operating so losses, and when carried forward to a subsequent year, they are to be treated as an expense on your Schedule C filing. You may not understand how tax credits work when they're we'll from a bad stop. debt. We'll so, him. here's a link to the IRS Little website. Momento. Little momento. I think it's me. So we're going to bring it all the way down to zero. Uh-oh. Go that way. All the way down to zero. And let's see if we can bring it down to zero and see what that does. On bad debt deductions, topic number 453, debt deduction. Okay, be quiet, be quiet, be quiet, be quiet. And let's bring you back down to zero. Because I need him going faster. And that's going to be tools, I believe. Nope, that's extracting and all that. I need speed! Because he's talking too slow. So, I need speed. Speed. Audio files. No settings. No. Audio output. Nope, not that. Voice pitch. Volume rate. Voice. Nope, that's not it either. And... I don't know why I got the... Oh, Neil Diamond. Sweet Caroline. It was on the news last night, and it's stuck in my head just now. Because uh, I haven't heard the song in a while, and so it came on last night, and it's been in my head ever. Sweet Caroline. Um, ladies and gentlemen, I do want to thank you guys for doing that. What I need to do is I need to figure out how to pick up the pace with the voice, because it's moving too slow. But what I was trying to do is show you guys that if you create the text, you can take this text and put it into 
this software, Quillbot. Quillbot, I paid for the premium version, okay? Premium! The reason why I did that is because this software will take the words that I put together and it will paraphrase it. Paraphrase it. Terraform it. It will allow. Okay. And so what happens is if I say paraphrase, it's 1,323 words. I want it to paraphrase. So it's going to use this AI system and it's going to reword it. Okay, because you all and I, we don't talk the same. Okay, now remember, this is 1323, and this is 260, 1260, 1262, and we wait, we wait. It's got 43 or 44 and 1272, and it got rid of some words. There you go. It took this right here and it reworded it so those of you who and then you have a plagiarism check you can check to see if it's been plagiarized click rephrase to compare sentences of different modes and we can do that see ta-da there you go that's why i got this because it will be useful in putting together some videos where i'm not sounding like a lawyer and using terms that because a lot of people are telling me that it's too much for them and they can't handle it. It's not that they're telling me that they're stupid or dumb because that's not what they're saying. They're saying that I'm using terms and explaining things that they are not familiar with. And so what this does, watch this. We're going to read this. You should be aware that tax credits are money that lowers someone's tax obligation and will do so indefinitely or until they run out. These credits, which are the consequence of bad debt deductions and or net operating losses, and when carried forward to a following year, are to be considered as an expense on your Schedule C filing, and they can be applied to back taxes for up to five, no, five years. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's what this did, and so I'm going to take this. Come on, all the way up, all the way up to the tippity tippity top, and we copy. Not only did it redo what I said, now I gotta find a software. I don't know if it's gonna be Balabolka. Balabolka. I don't know if it's gonna be Balabolka, but if it is Balabolka, you guys, this is a free software. Okay, Balabolka. Is a free software. Bala Bolka is a free software. All you got to do is go to B A L A B O L K A. Okay, Bala Bolka is a free software and it does text to speech. It just won't let me delete it because I'm doing too much. Let's see if I can get this. To, let's see, we're going to open another one do that one right there that way we'll take care of that and then we're going to copy and paste and i just see that's exactly give me a second let me make sure uh you should be aware that tax credits are money this is the one so let's see if we can get this thing to speed up let's choose another voice because maybe steve-o is the problem so dave oh snap okay that's how I choose the speed. One second. Watch this. Let's see if that you works. You should be aware that tax credits are money that lowers someone's tax obligations and will do so indefinitely or until they run out. These okay. credits, which are the consequence of bad debt deductions and or net operating losses, and when... Hold on. Let's do that again. And or net operating wrong. losses, and when carried forward to a following year, to be considered as an expense on your Schedule C filing, and they can be applied to back taxes for up to five years. Here is a link to the IRS website's topic page on bad debt deductions, which will explain how tax credits that result from bad debts function. Topic number 453, this article from the Internal Revenue Service, ears.governor, titled Bad Debt Deduction, discusses how one can write off things like wages, salaries, rent, dividends, interest. Come on, Crystal. Give her a second, y'all. She she's she's getting herself together because she gotta be presentable when she she talking to y'all. 
So y'all got to just bear bear with Crystal, okay? And I can't stay on too long because the dogs are going to get mad at y'all. Um, the dogs are, they've been eating, but... Here is a link to the IRS website stop a page on bad debt deductions, which will explain how tax credits that result from bad debts function. Topic number 453. This article from the Internal Revenue Service, irs.gov, titled Bad Debt Deduction, discusses how one can write off things like wages, salaries, rent, dividends, interest, and similar expenses. The important thing to remember is that bad debts are tax deductible. As a result of bad debts, you have obtained what are known as transferable tax credits. But, since you are not a part of the company that got them, you are not permitted to transfer them a second time after receiving them. You won't need to alter your accounting procedures for writing off tax credits as business expenses in order to fully enjoy the benefits of tax credits. According to topic number 407 Business Income Vertical Bar Internal Revenue Service, irs.gov, due to the debt, you must report these credits as a, okay, as a business well, expense on... Shut up, woman! As a business expense on... Okay. On Ladies Schedule C. Look, I just, I'm going to stop you all together. Forget that. Ladies and gentlemen, let me explain something. The pitch, you see how this is at, all the way at 176? I, from 0 to 176, that's a whole lot. So that's Crystal. Let's go back to that, that Steve-O character. Okay, let's see what he, ha you know what, we're not going to do 44. Let's do 22. Let's see what Steve-O sounds like. Now, you don't have to get this particular Here's software. a link to the IRS website's topic page on bad debt deductions, which will explain how tax credits that result from bad debts function. Topic number 453. This article from the Internal Revenue uh -oh, Service. Here's dot governor. Titled bad debt deduction. Discusses how one can write off things like wages, uh -oh. salaries, rent, dividends, interest, and similar expenses. We're gonna have to the important here. thing to remember is that bad debts are tax deductible. You see how he's now it's now caught up. So now, but I gotta bring this down. So we're gonna go all the way back down to 170. No, let's do 165 if y'all don't mind. Yeah, we'll do 165. So you guys, I, I, what I'm doing right now is to help some of you guys who use this, and I'm gonna explain why I would use this for what reason. So we're gonna go back here, and we're gonna play. As a result of bad debts, you have obtained what are known as transferable tax credits. But since you're not a part of the company that got them, you are not permitted to transfer them a second time after receiving them. You won't need to alter your accounting procedures for writing off tax credits as business expenses. Hold on, let's do. Link it to the IRS website's topic page on bad debt deductions, which will explain how tax credits that result from bad debts function. Topic number 453. This article from the Internal Revenue Service, Here's dot governor, titled "Bad Debt Deduction," discusses how one can write off things like wages, salaries. Hold on. No, Here's a link here. to the IRS website's topic page on bad debt deductions, which will explain how tax credits that result from bad debts function. Topic number 453. This article from the Internal Revenue Service, Here's dot governor, titled Bad Debt Deduction, discusses how one can write off things like wages, salaries, rent, dividends, interest, and similar expenses. The important thing to remember is that bad debts are tax deductible. As a result of bad debts, you have obtained what are known as transferable tax credits. But, since you're not a part of the company that got them, you are not permitted to transfer them a second time after receiving them. You won't need to alter your accounting procedures for writing off tax credits as business expenses in order to fully enjoy the benefits of tax credits, according to topic number 407, Income Internal Revenue Service, here's dot governor. Due to the debt, you must report these credits as a business expense on Schedule C of your income tax return because they result from a business bad debt as described in the aforementioned IRS tax issue 453. As a result, you will not owe any taxes as a result of receiving this transfer. This transfer is tax-free and does not result in a capital gain. If you use IRS tax topic 453 for any debt and losses that you incur, you must use the following form to switch your reporting method from the cash method to the accrual method. This information can be found at filing and paying your business taxes internal revenue service, here's dot governor. Unless you're writing off other bad debt, in which case you can only receive the full benefits if you're using what's known as the accrual method of accounting under GOP, generally accepted accounting practices, guidelines, you won't need to change your accounting method for the purposes of receiving the credits and applying them. If you're wondering why you're receiving this, it's because the genuine God I worship has given me the knowledge necessary to comprehend both fundamental contract law and the arbitration procedure that operates under the Federal Arbitration Act. In order to implement an arbitration clause, you must alter the contract with another party with whom you conduct business. This is known as a notice of change in terms of a... Okay, ladies and gentlemen, what I've demonstrated here 
is this. Tome plus this software will allow you all to create videos that are text videos where you can have a voice reading the video. There are several free software that you can utilize, those of you who would like to create your own videos. You can use perplexity.ai or OpenAI, which are all free, to create your context by just simply asking a question and letting it answer your question. Uh, give me a second. I got to pause y'all for a second. Give, sorry, ladies and gentlemen. The reason why I had to pause you is because I had a video. I mean, not a video, emails here, and I didn't want to show you somebody's stuff, you know, because y'all ain't supposed to be looking in nobody else's stuff. Okay, so this is Quillbot.com. Q-U-I-L-L-B-O-T. This is the thing that will help you take care of your grammar, and they have a free version of it. You don't have to get the uh, year version of it. This is Tone. You'll get to create your own background, your own bra. Uh, all you have to do now. Let me let me explain this so that you guys get it. Let's say this is my portfolio. No, we have to do it from the beginning. I apologize because you guys are going to be here. So let me show you how you do it. You're going to click on create when you go into tone. It says title. So what we're going to do for our title. Jimmy cracks corn but I could care less. Apologize, ladies and gentlemen, that's what happens when you use uh, speech recognition. So I put Jimmy Crack Corn, but I could care less. That's the title of this particular document. Many of you could create your own stories. It's generating an outline based on my Jimmy Cracks Corn. This presentation will explore why the popular blah, 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 and look at what it does. Now, I could click on this symbol here. Watch this. Oh, it's still it's still populating. Now it's creating seven pages so far on Jimmy's cracking corn. You see how simple that is. You all I had to do was put in a phrase. I could put in a phrase how to create a GPT. Don't know what a GPT is, but I could put how to create a GPT. Now you see how he created this picture? I don't like that picture. Well, don't matter. Okay, don't matter what I like. We're gonna take care of that later. See this right here? I'm going to hit that button just once and see these are the different pages. See? And this is going to talk about Jimmy. Jimmy keeps, keeps cracking corn, ladies and gentlemen. Okay? Jimmy shouldn't be cracking corn. That's why I don't care because he ain't got no business cracking corn. Stupid mother. I mean, you know, that's Jimmy. So after you do that, go back here. Take Jimmy backwards because Jimmy don't need to be all the way up here with everybody else. Hold on. Now, where's my Jimmy cracking corn? There's Jimmy. Okay, so we're gonna now we're gonna click on Jimmy. Pay attention. Oh, I'm sorry, I gotta go back. I gotta show you guys what I did so that you'll know. This is personal because it's always personal. You click on personal, then you click on the one that you were just working on. Come on, hurry up, Jimmy. Okay, you see where it says Jimmy Crack Corn? Well, I wanna have get get out of here. I want to have a picture, so I'm going to go here to daily, and I'm going to go C-O-R-N. No, we're going to M-A-N. We're going to put corn man. I don't know what a corn man looks like, y'all, but let's see if it's going to be able to generate a picture of some stupid thing called a corn man. Give me a second. Tick tock, tick. Well, look at that. We got ourselves some corn man. We're going to pick up this one right here. This is going to be our corn man. He looks just like a corn man. Got his husk and everything. See? Look at the husk. Anyway, all right. That's the first picture. So if you want to add a picture, that's how you add a picture, okay? You want to add two pictures? You just sit up here and click on this again, and then you just corn man the sequel. 
hold on, corn man number two. Got to pick another corn man. Jimmy cracks corn and he doesn't care. See, corn man. Come on, hurry up, corn man. This is corn man number two. Uh oh, that looks like the same corn man, but he ain't got on no vest. Oh, look, well, look at this one. This is going to be corn man number two. I'm going to choose him as corn man number two. Now, I could keep picking and picking and picking. Oh, look at that. It's Chucky. Okay. I could. Oscar. No, Chucky. Oscar. No, Chucky. Jose. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that was racist. No, it wasn't. Ladies and gentlemen, Jimmy is cracking cone and, and nobody else cares, but I care. All right. So we got the pictures. You know how to put the pictures. But wait a minute. Is this all Jimmy can do? Hold on, this is too big. This 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 writing right here is too big. Hold on. Come on. The whole thing. Let's let's select select it. Now that's like I said, it's too big. So we're gonna go header. Okay. Whew. Now let's say I want to add some language to this. So what we do is let's add some language. Where is the paste at? Okay, that's the language. That's too much language, but that's the language. That's how you add. Wait, hold on. Let me show you. We're gonna Get on, ease on down, ease on down the road, hole. corn on the hob. Corn on the cob? No, corn on the hob. Let's get rid of that. Okay, so that's the first. Now we're going to go all the way down to the bottom. Go right here where, where we saw that right there. All right, I want to add some pages because this is too short. Hey, stop talking. Microsoft, what you doing? All right, we're going to give Microsoft some access. That's the... That starts Microsoft, so we can choose what we want to add. Okay, so we're going to choose this. Ta-da! And then we're going to choose another one. Ta-da! And then we're going to choose another one. Ta-da! Eventually, I will change this. Okay, we get to put pictures or whatever we want to here. We get to create the slideshow. Ta-da! And with this slideshow, we can add the voices explaining, just like we told you with the other software, what it's saying. And then we can do a video of the whole thing. There are free softwares allowing you to do this. One of them is Descript. Descript? Descript. I haven't been using Descript, and I got, a, I got a, an account with Descript, and I need to start using Descript. So I'm going to start using Descript. Come on, Microsoft, what you doing? I'm all set? Good. Get on out of here. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, this is just me first saying thank you. Those of you who clicked on the link, I do appreciate it. Um, for how to use these softwares, we're going to do this right here. Let's see. It's got to be, is it this one? No, that's not it. That's not it. That's not it. That's the wrong one. It ain't this one. I think it is this one. This is it right here. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to send you guys two links. I'm going to send you the link for this video, text-to-speech converter, where this guy is explaining this and the different software. That's the first one I'm going to send you. Then I'm going to send you a video showing you how to use Tome and the other softwares to create a video. I think it will be very helpful to those of you. Do you mind? 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 And these are all free softwares. I think it would be beneficial to all of you. Again, my job is to help you. So I'm glad some people realized, and I'm glad they signed up. Now, look, hold on. The issue was you get 500 credits for signing on the tone. 500 credits. Now, I just lost about 100, no, about 30 credits just doing what we just did because it counts the credits against me for using the software to do that. So for demonstrating that, 30 credits gone. I'm so sorry. Anyway, but each one of you received 500 credits. Okay, each one of you received 500 credits for signing on, so thank you. But the software doesn't do you any good unless somebody shows you how to use it. And what I saw was some people, there are not a lot of videos on Tone. So I saw a lot of people talking about they didn't know how to edit it. So what did I do? I showed you how to edit Tone. Ta-da! And that's what I do. Okay, I took the time to learn what somebody else said they couldn't do because I need to explain this to you guys. I contacted the company that is the startup for Tome. And I told them I was not going to let the people on my channel know about Tome unless they showed me that they cared about customer service and they cared about people. So what did they do? Not only did their head customer service person contact me back, 
but he spoke about the customer service aspect first and not the technical issues I was having first. So he put the customers first. He did that on purpose. And that's what I was looking for. I was looking for somebody who is going to treat you all like your people. And then he took care of the technical issue and said, these are his words. If any one of you get to the point to where you run out of credits and you need additional credits, all you have to do is email them. They will work something out with you. Because this is a beta software. Tome is beta. So it's not fully out there. So you're in on the beta program. You might as well get in now because there might be some discounts. I also said it would be very good if they worked it out to where you didn't have to refer a friend. It would be better if they worked it out to where people could actually purchase credits. And I just told him to get that to the higher upper echelons. But, the, but here's the thing, ladies and gentlemen. He contacted me back and he communicated. That's what I was looking to see. See, SACOM, AmeriLegion, AMCF, all of those organizations are very small. There's only four people working on customer service for the seven, 12 different organizations. Please understand this. So we can't get to every email. I'm receiving, I received 80 emails by 8 o'clock yesterday in the a.m. from 12 a.m. to 8 a.m. 12 a.m. to 8 a.m., 80 emails. That was just yesterday. We're not even talking about all the emails I received. Oh, God, I'm looking at 50 emails now in the last hour. Most of them are, you know, people signing up for Tome. Thank you. But, again, it's a lot of emails, a lot of responses. Then we have a lot of people who are overly insistent. So let me tell you what I'm planning on doing. If you watch this video and the other links that I put in here, you're going to see one guy says he uses a particular software to respond to emails. Uh, this is, um, I forgot the young man's name. Uh, he has a uh, Brokowski or something like that. And that's not him. Let's, let's go backwards. Let me see if I can find him. Ah, cause you, I'm definitely referring you guys to his video. Get out of here. Speech people. Where are you at youngster? I These think... four AI tools there he will make is. you 10 times... Hey, Brett, Brett, stop. His actual name is Brett. <laughs> and I forgot that part because I didn't focus on that. Malinowski. Okay? Brett is all right. He is goes out of his way to explain things to you, and he's telling you guys how to do it for free. Okay? But he's a YouTuber. He makes money off of his platform. Is he making money off of you? No, because he's giving you the free information. Am I referring you to him? Yes. Why? Not because his name is Brett, but because I've listened to several videos of his, and he takes the time to explain. So if you're, look, people are trying to figure out how to make money. If you're trying to get into the YouTube game and figure out how to make money, people like him, they'll show it to you. His link will be underneath the video, and the other individual's links will be underneath the video. Check out their videos. I don't know none of these people. I've only watched a couple of videos of this young man, because he takes the time to explain this new technology that's coming up, this GPT, the chat GPT. And this is him again telling you seven best AI business ideas. This is five or oh, four AI tools, okay? Take a look at his latest videos and I'm sure you'll understand. See, Tome and Quillbot. Where do you think I got them from? I got them because he suggested them, ladies and gentlemen. And this is Notion AI, that's the one that will really help many of you with notations and billing and all of that stuff that's what you want okay so ladies and gentlemen 29 minutes to explain this 28 minutes to explain the other remember i don't get paid for this those of you who don't understand satcom and AmeriLegion and all i don't get paid for that you guys are not paying me many people think they're putting money in my pocket people i don't get paid for doing this. I don't get paid for helping out SACOM. That's all volunteerism. Okay? Y'all need to understand this. This is being done to help you. I don't do anything of any personal gain. I'm not trying to get personal gain. All right. We're going to explain one more thing so you guys understand what's going on. I don't need your money. Don't want your money. I'm not asking for it. I asked you guys for your help 2020 
one and you helped me and i said okay that's it stop no mas you guys remember that well what you did is you gave me the ability of setting up the staff for the tax credits and not having to worry about day to day ladies and gentlemen we told you about the young lady who filed her taxes she actually just called me earlier today who filed her taxes her agent wrote it off i explained to her why he did what he, the way he did well if she was able to do that and Donald Trump is able to do it and everybody else is able to do it. Why haven't you been doing it? Because nobody took the time to explain it to you. I told you if you helped me, I would provide you the information. Have I not been providing information, 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 information to you? Have I asked you for anything? I just asked you to sign up the tone through my link. That was it. The link that's under the video, the previous video, I asked you, please just sign up to that link. Because why? I don't get any money for it. It gives me the ability of producing the content and give you guys different voices and things like that. That's what I'm doing. Okay? Holler if you hear me. No, 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 holler. Because I, I don't want to hear you. Holler. All right. So I want to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The script for the taxes that we just did, you guys understand this. You have the script in the last video on Tome. Just copy and paste it into the software that we just told you about, the Quellbot, and have it rephrase it for you so that you can understand what's being said. Didn't you see how much clearer that information was? But I can't talk like that naturally because that's not how I sound naturally. It's not how I put words together. But it took what I said and it put it together for you all. And it was simplistic. Because all you need is a basic understanding so you can move forward. So when you do read the technical mumble jumble, you understand it. Now, I got started in all of this with Unreal Engine. Unreal Engine 5.1 now. Because the matrix and everything else is being made with Unreal Engine. There are a couple of other ones out there, but Unreal Engine is the one standing in the forefront. Because of Unreal Engine, then came ChatGPT. And in ChatGPT, something else is going to come along, and then something else is going to come along after that, and something else is going to come along. But you all need to understand, now is the time to stay on tip, on pace, and in motion with this, because if you can master these softwares, pay attention, then you'll be the first to start making monies off of it. It's all technical. Some of you are not technically savvy. That's why you have individuals doing tutorials. Ta-da! All right, ladies and gentlemen, yes, I told you that's my new word. Ta-da! Anyway, I want all of you to have a very good day, have a very good weekend. Those of you who are my people, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for clicking on the link. You really need to know I needed that. I needed to have my faith restored in the American people. So thank all you non-Americans for signing and on to Tome. They're going to love you foreigners. Really appreciate it. You all have a good day. Have a good life. Have a good night. And have a good experience. We will speak to you the next time. Goodbye, everyone.